Zelensky on the rescue efforts at that uh, theater that was bombed. What did we learn? You know what, that, that situation is actually looking uh, more dire than it did about 24 hours ago. Um, President Zelensky, you're absolutely right, he, he did say um, that around 130 people had already been saved uh, from that theater, but right now the authorities are, are telling us that they can't really give any more updates beyond that at this point. And you know, we were hearing 130 people had gotten out uh, about 24 hours uh, before this uh, as well. The big issue that they have in Mariupol, and it's one that's obviously becoming worse by the minute, is that that building was hit, that building collapsed on the bomb shelter where authorities believe around 1,300 people were sheltering in there, and they simply can't get to them. That's because all the emergency services are just not there anymore because they're defending the city or have been hit by the Russians. And they also say that they're doing this at a time that Russian strikes continue on a very regular basis. Obviously, Mariupol getting hit by a lot of munitions uh, pretty much uh, around the clock. So it makes it very difficult. And what the authorities are saying is, look, every hour that passes, every minute that passes, that those people are trapped in there, more difficult to help people survive. And so, Fred, today, uh, Russia's...